So, finally, DJI teased the most anticipated action camera of the year, the Osmo 360. And it's going to be released on the 31st of July. DJI has named the event All-in-One, hinting at the upcoming 360 camera that is designed to fulfill all your on-the-move filming needs. Though Tipster suggested earlier in a leak that the Osmo 360 might launch sooner, probably right in this month. And now DJI has officially confirmed it. Previously, we have seen a leaked combo box that shared detailed specs, sensor information, and pricing. For those who are waiting for the DJI's answer to Insta360, here are the key features you should expect from the upcoming Osmo 360. DJI seems pretty confident with the Osmo 360, at least that's what the teaser suggests. They claimed the Osmo 360 to be an all-in-one action camera. Well, DJI has certainly made the camera very powerful on paper. Jasper Ellens shared images of the box that included the price tag as well. He claimed that it was found at an Australian store, so the price is likely to be around $500. At the back of the box, you can see a quick glimpse of the specs, which starts with a 1-inch 360 imaging. DJI has used an innovative square sensor design that ensures a 1-inch 360-degree image while effectively reducing power consumption and device size. Paired with an f1.9 aperture, it delivers exceptional image quality, even in low light conditions. Besides, DJI is expected to utilize a new pixel allocation scheme, enabling 8K 360-degree filming with 2.4 UM pixels and ultra-high dynamic range, comparable to professional cameras you will be able to capture native 8K 360 videos right out of the box. Though Insta360 also offers 8K video capturing, the Osmo 360 is expected to ensure improved image quality by 77% compared to standard 5.7K sensors. The box also confirms support for 10-bit DLogM for both 360 and standard videos. The DLogM mode will enhance overall dynamic range, preserving details in highlights and shadows, while offering greater flexibility for color grading in post-production. Moreover, the Osmo 360 will feature a magnetic quick-release system and a one-quarter thread, just like the rest of the action cameras from DJI. What makes 360 cameras so unique is the creative ways of capturing videos with the invisible selfie stick, and DJI wasn't going to miss out on that especially when they directly want to compete with the Insta360. However, the selfie stick won't be available with the standard bundle and needs to be purchased separately. As for the battery life, DJI claims that the Osmo 360 will let you capture up to 100 minutes of 8K ultra-high resolution videos. That's more than enough for a 360 action camera. However, when you compare it with the Insta360 X5, the X5 offers up to 200 minutes of shooting time, which is way more than the DJI. We would still appreciate it if DJI could control the overheating issue. The DJI Osmo 360 is clearly aiming straight at the Insta360 X5 and the GoPro Max 360. They basically copied everything from their biggest competitors in the videography industry. And although the prices aren't confirmed yet, I'll bet they will sell it just a little cheaper. So, do you think the DJI Osmo 360 will be able to beat Insta360 and turn out to be the next leader in the 360 action camera market? Throw all your thoughts in the comments, give this video a thumbs up, and subscribe to our channel to keep yourself updated with all the latest tech news.